everyone. It's Jean from the Ink Owl Studio. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, I appreciate you uh, spending a few minutes and this is a very short, uh, it's like under 10 minute video. And I just wanted to show you how I made this little cute uh, extra on the flap uh, so that when you opened it up, it's got a nice little backing. Um, this is a piece that came with the digital kit for my porch prints, but this could be anything. This could be a uh, any shape uh, round uh, punch out a big round circle or it, it, it could be a piece of ephemera that you do this with you can just do it with anything and um, so I wanted to show you how to do that I had pre-recorded it along with putting the box together but I broke it up into two videos rather than one long one so it won't be very long and before I get started with that I did want to say that recently uh, YouTube all of a sudden showed me about 50 comments from people about a year ago. Did uh, They just appeared in my feed and it's just the weirdest thing. And I read through them and I felt so bad because some of you had asked questions and uh, important questions and I had not gotten back to you probably wondered what I was doing and I'm, I apologize deeply for that and I, um, I answered uh, as many as I I could or I felt that needed to be answered right away. So if you got an, a, a, a message from me on YouTube that was a year old, well, <laughs> then that's where it came from. So I do apologize for that. Um, I am going to have to find out a different way to watch for the comments because I kind of thought that I had had it all set up the way it's supposed to be and I don't know. So sorry about that. Um, Anyways, thank you so much for viewing, and so we're going to go into the instructions of this. So I have an eyelet that I put there, and I'm going to get my ribbon and go out like this. So one part of the ribbon will be strung that way, and the other one is going to be strung out the other, um, the other eyelet down here. And then these two will be glued together. And put up through here. I'm just showing you what the result's going to look like. And this come around like that. And then um, tie it down here. So that is the preliminary experiment. Of course, this, this whole video has been a bit of an experiment. But you know. Sometimes it's how we learn. We just get out there and get her done and see what happens. So let me um, put an eyelet in through here like so. And get that one inside. And I'm pretty sure this is going to work. Uh, hey, it's working in my head. <laughs> in my imagination, this works perfectly. So let's just see how good my imagination is, right? And let me cut off a, a good share here so that I have enough. Or maybe I should thread it this way. This might be better to uh, thread it towards the bottom first. And then reach around my box. Hold on to it here to see how much I'm going to be needing. Okay. Get that about right. Alrighty. Looks like maybe right about here would be a good place to cut it. We still have enough left. And come through the top portion like this here and then this I think this idea helps lengthen the flap a little bit because I still came out with a little tiny flap now I don't know why but I did all right and there we are we've got that much done and now I'm going to mount 
um, this up here probably, hmm, maybe I'll mount it even with that area right there. So let me apply glue. And I think I'm going to use a Fabri-Tac for this with it. Okay. And I'm just going to glue these two pieces together. There we are. Just like that. Alright. So it's critical that these match down here, but here they don't have to match exactly because they won't be seen together. And then I will be gluing each side separately to there. And I had better get the middle because it would not look good if it isn't. So let me get my little, little guy out here and uh, find the middle. Come down a little bit. Looks like right there's the middle. So I will want my point to come up there. Like so. And come right up there. All right. Oh, yay. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. And glue the inside. I like this idea. This is a good idea for um, any kind of a flap, actually. Hmm, I'm going to have to keep this in mind for other flaps. I like the idea. Let me put a little bit inside here. And glue that in together. Oh, how cute. I do like it. And then this will come down. And then we can tie a bow. Like right here in front. Yeah. And we can still see that cute little um, tap there in front. So there is the closing yay. And the, uh, the seam back here, which I probably shouldn't have sewn it because then I wouldn't really be seeing it. But what I think I am going to do here is I'm just going to glue some, gl some lace along here and all the way to the front and I think that'll I think it'll dress it up kind of kind of cute there I might even put um, maybe a little bit of lace along here on the lid yeah well we'll see but that's what my plan is for the rest of this little folder envelope. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned a few tips in here and a few ideas that maybe you know you'll want to try with your own um, projects. And um, so please subscribe. I am going to be taking a break from the Etsy shop for a few weeks so um, I probably won't do a final flip through of all of my uh, components here until then. So, um, but please I'll be looking for it eventually down the road and, um, yeah, we'll talk to you later then. Bye.